Alrighty, guys. Today, I thought I'd share with you guys some things about bunny compost while I show you how I pick them. Say hi to Jagon. He's such a darling. Anyways, guys. So, um, recently, I changed the packaging of my um, bunny compost. That is because I wanted to offer a larger amount in just one bag. And um, so far, it's been taking a while because it's just one bunny that we have here. And um, what I do is that I handpick them, as you can see in the video. That way, you're actually getting what you paid for, which is just the compost. It doesn't have a mixture of pallets and other things because I'm handpicking them. So why bunny compost, guys? Well, let me tell you why. About a year ago, I didn't know much about bunny compost. But while reading, I found out that, you know, I like things that are just quick and let's get it over with. I found that with bunny compost, I could apply it right away. I don't have to wait, like, for you for months and months before I can use it and I was like what I can just apply it like that that that's pretty cool that's the thing it's called cold compost meaning that you just use it right away you just you just throw the bunny compost you can just throw it in your garden and it gets to work or you can make tea out of it and you know have it seep through into through, seep uh, through into the soil so what I typically do, especially, especially for herbs, is that when I'm transplanting them, I dig a hole. When I dig the hole, I put the bunny compost in there because I'm going to eat the leaves of the herbs. I don't want but poop on it, right? As much as it's cute and it doesn't smell, um, I don't want to eat bunny compost, right? So I, I, I put it in the roots of the plant. Otherwise, I make tea out of it and just directly feed the, the roots with bunny compost. The other thing about bunny compost is that it has four times as much nutrients than a cow or horse manual, right? Did you guys know that? Isn't that just awesome? That small little thing has four times as much manual, I mean, nutrient than the horse manual. And again, I just come in to find out like people actually go buy worms for their garden which is nothing nothing bad about that but if you have rabbit manure in your garden you can be rest assured that worms are following you after after that because worms love rabbit manure so it's like an added benefit and the other thing about it i mean for me i mean some people smell is not a bad thing but bunny compost actually doesn't smell at all the only time you smell it is if you make tea out of it like if you pour water on it and leave it for a couple hours then it's gonna start stinking and the other thing our garden needs is like nitrogen, phosphorus, potassium, and rabbit manure has plenty for you. It has plenty for you, which is one of the things I love about it. Like if you're looking to get some juicy leaves going on in your herbs, man, rabbit manure is just the one for you. So that's it, guys. If you guys want to try out bunny compost, check your local area. Otherwise, you can reach out to me. I ship nationwide. Uh, trust and believe. You need this for your garden. You won't regret it. It's an awesome thing to have. Alrighty.